Welcome to another Tempo Storm Meta Snapshot Breakdown. Since the last Meta Snapshot, a lot of decks previously believed to fall within Tier 2 have shifted out, landing themselves in the third tier. The disparity between tiers has become far more noticeable. And it's not just between Tiers 2 and 3. The Tier 1 lists of the meta are far beyond the other decks in the metagame, with Valera continuing to dominate. Only time will tell if Maestra or Null will see a change, but until then, let's take a look at the decks that you should play to put yourself in the best position possible. As we hinted, Miracle Rogue continues to sit at the top of the meta. It's no surprise to anyone, it has been dominating the meta for quite some time now. Players continue to use the power of Maestra and Nulls to swarm games, spending the early turns cycling their deck, and then pulling off a large combo turn using their location to generate a huge stealthed ghost. Your best matchup within the top two tiers is Shock Spitter Hunter, as they tend to struggle to interact with your threats. But against the other tier 1 deck, Quest Demon Hunter, you'll find that the game often comes down to execution. The matchup is fairly even. The next and only other deck making an appearance in tier 1 is Quest Demon Hunter. This archetype uses the quest to discount cards while cycling through your deck. Unlike older Quest Demon Hunter variants, you aren't at the mercy of your final quest reward. Even just your minor discounts can be enough to swing the game in your favor. With a combination of discounted spells and burst damage, you'll be able to continuously clear the board and push damage toward your opponent with little risk, leaving you to take over the game while cycling. In an unprecedented fashion, Tier 2 has not only less decks than the first tier, but it also, well, only has one deck. The only deck making an appearance in this tier is Shock Spitter Hunter. Despite the nerfs to this deck, it still remains as powerful as ever and continues to dominate the ladder. For players who like to play aggressive decks, this one is made for you. You can constantly apply pressure and burst damage thanks to Shock Spitter and the other powerful Hunter cards. Shock Spitter Hunter performs best against the majority of Tier 3 decks, preying on their less consistent nature, but it tends to fall a bit flat when facing off against the Tier 1 decks. Typically, we only take a look at the first two tiers for each meta snapshot, but due to how few decks make an appearance in these tiers, we want to also briefly take a look at the top two decks within the third tier. Thief Rogue is the first to make a name for itself in tier 3, sitting comfortably at the top. With access to Rogue's powerful tools alongside a bit of trickery, Thief Rogue can do some absolutely crazy things. Cards such as Jackpot can leave the game feeling like a game of slots, as the majority of the game will fall to what cards are randomly generated. It can be a great deck to play if you're looking for a hit of dopamine, but if you are looking for consistent, powerful results, consider playing Miracle instead. The last deck that we're looking at today is Evolve Shaman. Much like Thief Rogue, Evolve Shaman can be very random at times, thanks to the nature of Evolve cards. Generating a board of a bunch of random minions can change the course of the game seemingly out of nowhere, leaving a lot of decision points in a game to feel slightly pointless. On the other hand, Evolve Shaman is a ton of fun to play, so who cares if you're a opponents get to have fun. Consider checking out Evolve Shaman if you enjoy games that are unpredictable. We're expecting a balance patch any day now, so keep your eyes peeled. And unless your name is Jay Alexander, you're probably eager to see Rogue knocked it down a peg. Hopefully in the coming weeks, we see a change in the meta, but until then, these decks will be the best suited for ladder. We hope you enjoyed our meta snapshot breakdown. If you did, be sure to subscribe to be kept up to date with all of our Hearthstone content. Until next time!